Hey guys, today I'm going to do a review type thing on my new cheer shoes that I got. They are called Infinity Vengeances. <clears throat> and they come in this like black and red box that has a strap that you can put over your shoulder. And it has the infinity sign on one part, I mean on one side, and it says infinity across the other side. So, <coughs> hold on, I gotta open it. This is what the chair shoes look like. They are seriously like the lighter shoes I've ever felt. I think they're like 3.5 ounces, something like that. But the best part about these shoes is that they're really easy to tumble in because they have these holes in them that are like see-through because you can see my finger through them. And, um, they also have this thing at the back of the shoe, these two cushion things, and it supports the back of your heel. Whenever you, um, stunt, it has these grips at the bottom, so it's, like, really easy to stunt into. And then right here, it's got, like, it's harder than any part of the shoe right here and right here so it makes it easier to just like rebound off that part because it's so hard <coughs> and then another thing about this shoe is that it's extremely flexible see because I can bend it both ways and then whenever you're doing jumps hold on it's gotta focus but anyways whenever you're doing jumps my old cheer shoes, like, they wouldn't point my toes, like, at all. But these are, like, I don't know, it's just, like, easier to point your toes in these. But, yeah, the only negative things I have to say about this shoe is, like, the price. I think it's, like, $89, but I think it's still worth it. And then, right here, the back part, right here, it gave me a blister. But I think it might be just because they're brand new I've only worn them once and I haven't gotten used to them but here's another view and then one more thing is like this part right here right here it's like it's netty it's like I can't really describe it it's just like a net type thing and it's scratchy but yeah this is what the shoe looks like. And, um, I had to get a size bigger than what I normally wear because, um, the shoes run small. So, like, if you, if you wear, like, a size 6, get a 6.5 or a 7 because the shoes, like, like, let's say you ordered them offline, and you didn't know what size shoe you would need. Get a, like, a half size bigger than what you normally get, or a whole size bigger. Because I've heard that some people would order them offline with their regular shoe size, and then they'd be, like, way too small. Small, so they'd have to send them back. So, yeah. Thanks for watching.